So Tina, you had shoulder problems when you were young uh, because you're doing lots of, um, you did, we were a swimmer. And um, we're gonna pretend that you had a, a frozen shoulder now. What kind of different exercises or movements do you do to help your shoulder? Extremely simple ones. So I love to stretch out, turn over. I love to open my fingers. I love to do some bicep curls and tricep extensions work in this and then if you're able to go above your head once your shoulder starts improving i push to strengthen my shoulder and get this uh, really awesome definition in my shoulder so just above my head or up with my arms sometimes i take a rubber band and pull out Sometimes I use water bottles or cans of soup, but most of the time I use nothing. Great. And I notice your arms are very red, even purplish, and that's below the band. Above the band, it's, it's nice white. Did that ever bother you or get you nervous? It, it, it actually, in the very beginning, I questioned, are, are my bands on too tight? Is this, is this supposed to happen? Is it scary? Now I realize I pink up quickly because I respond so well to katsu, and this is part of what makes the healing so prominent is the blood flow. So I, I love seeing the, the, uh, the change in color, and it's just gotten more use of katsu. It, it happens a lot quicker to me.